Yo, what is going on everyone? Guiding Light here, and in this one, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can complete the brand new challenge to actually deal damage after knocking enemies back with the Black Panther's Shockwave. So this is a new challenge, and there's only really one way to complete it easily. So what you want to do is actually go into the Marvel Knockout mode, whether you play with a friend or not, doesn't really matter, but you do want to go into that game mode, and this is going to be the easiest way to actually get this challenge done. So go on into Marvel Knockout or Marvel Showdown, and once you load into the map, you want to bring up the minimap, and this is going to show you where all of the different superpowers are scattered around the map. So in order to find Black Panthers, you want to be on the lookout for his logo somewhere on the map. So if you just look at your minimap, there you're going to see a bunch of different superpowers spawning all over the place. So just look for the one that has the same logo as the Black Panther. So you can see it right here. This is the logo you want to be on the lookout for. So that's what you want to look for on the minimap. Once you have picked it up, as you can see, you can charge it up. And once it's fully charged, you're going to emit this pretty crazy blast, which should knock enemies back. So you can complete this challenge in this game mode. So once you have your superpowers, just go find some enemies. And I'll show you guys exactly what needs to be done. So once you guys have found some enemies, what you want to do is be charging up the shield as you're running at them. And as soon as it explodes, it should actually blast them back a little bit and deal a little bit of damage. Now immediately after that, you want to switch to something else, whether it be Thor's hammer or whatever else you pick up. It doesn't really matter, but you want to start doing damage as fast as you can. As you can see there, I ended up knocking them back again. The cooldowns aren't really that high in this game mode, which makes it even easier to complete this challenge. Now it will definitely take a few tries because you do have to do about a thousand damage and most of these items in this game mode don't do a crazy amount of damage so you will have to do this a few times but this is by far the easiest way to get it done. Now it won't show you any progress until you're about three or four hundred damage in so there's really no way to check if you're making progress on it or not just keep charging up the shield and then dealing damage right after and eventually once you do enough damage you should see the progress come up. If you don't see the progress come up straight away don't worry you're probably still gaining some progress. Just be on the lookout, maybe even bring up your challenge list if you want to, but as you can see right here as I died, I ended up getting a little bit of progress to actually pop up on the screen. So this is the easiest way to get it done. Hopefully this does help you guys out to get it done a little bit faster. If it does, be sure to drop a like down below, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.